Welcome to the Respliceable MPO Splice On Connector from Optics with three opportunities to splice the connector properly. Uh, no more one and done situations with this connector. It comes in three parts. The connector, the sleeve, and the boot. First step is to uh, put the boot through the fiber cable. And the second step is to put the sleeve through the cable. Now we're going to put the fiber in the uh, fiber holder, strip it, clean it, and cleave it. Don't forget to check for any cracks in the fiber by flicking it. And we put it on the machine. Now we'll go to the connector end and we're going to repeat the process. There's no special holder needed here. Just use a standard fiber cable holder with your fusion splicer. And once again, strip it, clean it and cleave it. Don't forget to flick it again. And here's our first opportunity to splice. It's a failed splice, so we're going to have to redo it again. Cut it in the middle of the splice. That'll give you a little bit more room to uh, re-splice the connector. And we're going to repeat the process of stripping, cleaning, and cleaving. And here we go, splicing opportunity number two. And it's a failed splice. This time it's two parts. So we're gonna try again. And we're gonna repeat the process in opportunity number three by stripping, cleaning, and cleaving. And we're going to do the other side. We're going to splice again. This time it's a success. So we're going to take the cable out of the machine, keeping the splice straight, slip the sleeve through over the splice area and put it in the oven. Once that's done, we just simply bring up the boot and we have a completed MPO splice on connector. So this uh, boot is very flexible and bendable and also provides better strain relief to fit inside any enclosure.